Good day to you people. My name is Mohit and uh, today I'll teach you how to make a clear box. Uh, what is clear box? Guys, uh, if you've uh, ever worked with a thick box or a light box, maybe uh, you probably encountered these terms uh, while working with Dreamweaver. You'll understand uh, very easily what uh, 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 a, a clear box is. Clear box is actually a gallery. It could even be a, a video gallery, it could be a, a photo gallery, it could be a sound gallery, it could be a YouTube uh, videos gallery too. So you can create a mixed gallery and that's the best part when working with the uh, Clearbox. And where do you get uh, the requisite files or the required files for Clearbox? What you need to do is, let's get started and uh, open up the website which is uh, www.adobecs5 that's my website guys and you have all the requisite files out there so uh, this is adobe cs5 this is the intro page introduction page and uh, right here on the top it says uh, clearbox photo video sound gallery files okay so i'll just click on the link and uh, i'll save the files once you save the zipped file, extract it, what I've done is I've extracted all the files and dumped it into um, a working folder, my site folder. Okay, I've called my site folder Clearbox and I've dumped all the files that I got from the zip file inside it. I've also opened up the main file which is Clearbox Gallery in Dreamweaver. I, I already have it open here in front of you okay there are a few instructions here uh, but say please replace these uh, three pictures and the thumbnails with your own so I have these three pictures actually they are just a repeat of the uh, original picture and uh, every thumbnail has its original picture uh, let me just show you what I mean let me take a preview in Firefox so it says uh, the moment you launch Firefox says uh, Clearbox is ready you click on the first image it uh, fades in it blows up and expands horizontally vertically and you see the first picture the moment you hover over you see next written here see guys next written here and you also see a next button here so also you see all the three pictures here right so what I'm going to do is also there's a play button here which says uh, when you hover over the play button says start the slideshow I'm going to hit this uh, this play button and you'll see a, a preloader running from left to right boom second picture and here comes the third picture you have a caption here where you can put your own title uh, you can uh, you can uh, click next previous you can uh, rotate the image counterclockwise or clockwise okay and uh, you can hit the the next button here as well you can hit the previous button here okay you can uh, stop the slideshow okay there's so many things that you can do with a clear box I just love it people you know guys who have worked with a thick box or uh, with the uh, with the light box earlier in Dreamweaver would know that probably Clearbox is a much much better option it's more advanced more powerful so guys uh, uh, working with uh, a Clearbox is very easy all you need to do is open up the HTML file which is Clearbox underscore gallery dot HTML in Dreamweaver and replace these three thumbnails and their respective original images with your own here in the images folder we just have one thumbnail and uh, one thumbnail and one original picture that I've repeated three times okay what you need to do is you need to select the first picture the first thumbnail rather you need to then point to your own picture which you need to dump in the images folder okay since I don't have any other picture I'm not doing it 
and you need to link it to this is the link okay you need to link the thumbnail to your own uh, its own original picture in the images folder in your working site folder I don't have the uh, any more pictures but I'm assuming when you'll be making your own slideshow you will be putting all your thumbnails and their respective original pictures in the images folder and this is the way you'll point to them and that's all that you need to do okay and you have your clear box working all the code and there's, there's not too much of a code is right here barely 16 lines of code it's all here uh, I've done all the hard work for you uh, by the way guys this was not created by me it's not my production it's not my creation it was done by someone else but I've just tweaked it here and there and made it uh, a little simple for you so once you have replaced these three thumbnails with your own thumbnails which you should be putting in the images folder okay this is my uh, local site folder this is the images folder this is the thumbnail and this is the respective picture for the thumbnail the picture here is uh, 400 by 300 pixels and the thumbnail is just 72 by 72 pixels guys you need to go to this images folder you need to dump your own thumbnails and their respective pictures get back to Dreamweaver select these three pictures one by one need to go to SRC and the link and you need to link the thumbnails with the help of this point to file okay show it the right thumbnail in the images folder and show it the right link to the respective bigger picture it's linked to and you are done just in case you need more than three pictures all you need to do is uh, just copy a little bit of a code okay once again and uh, let me show you this is the code excuse me if you need to um, replicate the code the best way to do is open the help file up okay and uh, this is the code here that I've repeated three times you just need to copy the code okay so just say copy get back to Dreamweaver and uh, just above the uh, h2 header just need to place the code there paste it and you'll have one more picture okay so I'll show it to you again you open up the help file which has the instructions on how to make a clear box you copy the code between the p pp uh, p tags the para tags just say a control c and dump the code here in dreamweaver code view and you're done okay guys so guys uh, i hope you liked uh, this uh, tutorial on how to make a clear box which is driven by javascript again guys this is not my creation but i do take credit to present it to you maybe in a simpler way or if you have any questions please um, do get in touch with me you can go to my website www.adobecs5.in in for india i'm here in india and in mumbai it's a very hot day very hot and sultry and um, you can go to my website you can contact me through skype you can put a mail to mohit at the rate adobe cs5.in or mohit's mail at the rate yahoo.com and the time and talent permitting i'll try and help you okay guys i'll see you next time with yet another tutorial on uh, uh, adobe dreamweaver cs5 probably flash cs5 or fireworks cs5 ciao bye bye